We're back at it with the Wild West Airsoft Roleplay Adventure at Valahack Airsoft Field in Chesapeake, Virginia, and we're deep into day two. The election is about to happen, and although I've gotten nine achievement coins, things got rough. I got caught alone in the woods with players saying they just wanted a selfie, who then shot and robbed me, trying to save my daughter and nephew, shot and robbed, trying to get a gold miner achievement. I have to take this call. And then my dogs were fighting a snake. My wife was freaking out. Come here, young man. But I'm finally back at the field. And now having the prospector achievement, let's see what happens in this election. I'll also announce the winner of the Elite Force Smoke Wagon signed by me, who answered my question right in my last video. And I've got a new question for you in this one, so watch closely. We're gonna go up there so that we can get some perspective and not die. Ladies and gentlemen of the town, we have three candidates. Currents, Mayor Jelly, also the woman, yeah. and Kalina Slim, the bartender. Yeah. So, without further ado, your current Mayor, Mayor Jelly. Mayor Jelly is building a reputation of corruption for supposed poison moonshine. He also didn't really win the election last year. Buddy Rose, why are you back in my town? Because I decided I don't care about your opinion. We'll deal with that in a minute, sir. Buddy Rhodes, the previous mayor, actually won the election last year, but has been banned from the town since Jelly's people stormed the town and claimed Jelly won. Ladies and gentlemen, I know there has been several accusations upon myself from a few other less than reputable people in this town sheriff <laughs> that i'm selling some illegal alcoholic beverages and they taste pretty good too now there have also been a few accusations that that said alcohol has been poisoned i assure you that i will drink that here right here in front of you this wait we have one test we can do we have two one from you in the general store who wants to see a test done Now, while we set that up, I'm going to set a few more words. I just want you all to remember that the things I do in my office to maintain the town's peace and prosperity, make sure that every single one of y'all keeps all of your valuable, hard-earned money and property without any taxes coming out of your pocket. Now, a few of my components here are saying that they want to tax y'all. If I remain in office, there will be no more taxes. And on top of that, we will lower the property costs of town residents so you can individually be a part of this town. I will pay you $10 to be quiet. Now to prove my innocence. First one up is the General Store's Moonshine. It's an unopened bottle. The seal's still on there. I'm going to give this a go. How's it taste? Tastes like, tastes like shoe polish, right? Tastes like it's gonna clean my guts out, like real good, like completely sanitized. Do it over there. Completely. And that's from the general store. Now let's see the mayor's moonshine. Can you handle your oh. No! Do you see how poisoned it is? No! My wife! Is there a doctor? Yeah. Somebody get a doctor up here! Yeah. 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 What is yeah. Did you have yeah. something to do with this? Take a sip. I'll take a sip. Down in one. 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 Yeah, we're getting a doctor. We're getting a doctor. Ladies and gentlemen. Silence! I am the woman. Yeah. Up until now, that has been the name that I have been known by. But today, I want to introduce myself. I am Guinevere Cartwright. I have my husband with me, and his name is Edwin Cartwright. 
Cartwright. You're wondering, what do I plan to do with this city? I have spent my time here getting to know our lovely, lovely community members, all of you. First and foremost, no taxation. Freetown, your money is your money and it will stay that way. Second, we will rid this town of corruption. I care about this city and the interest of all of you. You tell me what you want and we will make it happen. First of all, you want, you want to know where the money's going to come from. That's been my question all the time. taxes. What we plan to do is the criminals will be fine. <laughs> so they will be fined based upon what their crime is. What this will also do is it will lower the crime rates. But then you say, where will the rest of the money come from if there's no more crime? We have beautiful lands. We will plant tobacco. We will plant much struggling right now. So what we will do with this money as it comes in, we will build up this town. It will be beautiful again. Yeah! We will plant more re for reforestation for our trappers. And with this will come livestock and more ranchers. We will continue to bring money in for our community. Yeah! So please consider me the woman for mayor. I just figured I'd go live on here because I was like, I could do that. All right, one last candidate. These are the different candidates. Give it up. Anyone can run for the best bartender in Bellahack. Cletus Flynn. Woo! I'm sure all of y'all have seen my posters around town, so I'm gonna just go on and explain my points right quick. Number one, the train's gotta go. Hang on now. Has anybody noticed that whenever the train comes into town, the outlaws come and shoot everybody up? So without the train, there'd be no outlaws and no crime. Second of all, we're gonna get rid of all schools. Because everything you need to know can be learned by trains. Horses and carriages, just like we used to. Boo! Number three, we're gonna raise taxes. Now hear me out, hear me out. Sounds like taxes. We're gonna raise taxes. Sounds like taxes. That's Without good. money, the city She's can't running. grow. And we want this city to flourish and grow. So we need to pay a little bit extra to grow the city. We don't get enough of those. And my final point, if I'm elected mayor, all the booze will be free for the rest of the day. So please keep that in mind when you cast your ballots. I am Cletus Slims, your favorite bartender. Thank you very much. This is C7 Viper, Chuck and Mike. This is Swamp Sniper, South Park. For the woman! <laughs> For your favorite bartender, Cletus Slim! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen! Listen up! Listen! Ruhe Bitter, listen! Thank you! Ladies and gentlemen! Please give a round of applause for your new mayor, the woman! Speech, 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 speech.
because she won as the, uh, as the mayor. Oh, Next year, God, she is the mayor. so humble to have this opportunity to serve you. I cannot wait to see what we do as a community to build up this city. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Free town. Free town. Free town. All right. Normally, this is the point where everyone just kills everyone. People of town, one more thing. Your mayor speaks. First of all, the first thing I want to do as mayor, there was an injustice done last election. And I would like to bring him back into our city. to Freetown! Thank you. Woo! Woo! And as I have already announced earlier today, I took my money into the saloon, and I already paid for your drinks for the day. Yeah. Yeah. And, 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 ladies and gentlemen, your food. Ah. Oh. We got barbecue showing up at the general store any moment. So the woman is the new mayor-elect, but what does this mean? And will the existing mayor actually leave his office? Also, I'm live streaming, so I decided to show you this because I like to show you everything. So let's see what happens. Yeah. Oh, this is shady. It's a security protection. Everyone's just chilling. We're all chilling. Mr. Pinkerton, how are you? Sir. <laughs> Hey, what you what are you what are you doing? Reaching for that gun there. You good? Alright. What's up? We're live on oh! Ding. Is this for me? Can I hit you with it? Sure. Keep my wife's name! What's up? What's up? Just so you know, we are uh, we are live on Instagram. I was like, I'm just gonna keep this thing rolling. So uh, you know, keep that in mind. <laughs> So I have a lot of property and earlier he asked for property for sale and I said he better go get some money. So now he's saying he's got money. Now I think we should start the bond process. Look, it's simple. How much money are you going to pay for it? Well, I'd like to start low. Uh, low Alright, you're really almost losing your chance to get the land. That's 800. 800? Bump that to 850. Do 850? We did 850 for our last lot that we sold. 850? I'll do a, a flat 900. Well, I'll tell you what, since I like the direction of this, how about a flat thousand and you don't get the land? No, I'm saying. <laughs> Surprise! We can do that. Alrighty. In fact, I, I'm not even going to just sign you on your own. I'm going to, um, I'll give you your own piece of land entirely. That sounds very good. Entirely. Here we go. Can you orchestrate this, Doug? Guys, this is Doug. He's a king. Thank you. Everybody needs a Doug in their life. Ian, I finally found you. Except this time it's live on Instagram. If you know my stuff, you know Ian. I am always looking for him. The poor guy. Sheriff's office in here. Funny. I'm sitting right here so I don't this get is, caught. This is, yeah, a, this case is a different appearance. Mi mistaken identity. Mm. Looks pretty look, close look, to me, look, doesn't look, it, you? I have on the reliable. I have, I have on the victim source that this is not the same man. Yeah, it's we, not. No, look, he has a pocket. I don't have a pocket. Wait. Pocket? No What pocket. do you guys think? <laughs> Vote now. Is that the same man or what? Looks <laughs> pretty close. No, no, no. Look at the shirt. Pocket. No, look, look, the shirt is a button-up shirt with the collar. This is a V-neck. Maybe he did. No, mm -mm. same thing. Mm. Yeah, there isn't He's got short well, hair. No. <laughs> I'm live on uh, Instagram right now. Let's talk to Jet Desert Fox. Wait. Sir, you're under arrest. Sir, I need you to come with me. Nice and calm. Do you already know that you're wanted? Just, just come on over here. It's okay. You just need to talk. Maybe it's a misunderstanding. Hey, sir, I need you to just go over there right now. Well, let's, you know, sir, is this you? That's not you. 
Are you, wait, wait, we got the hug in. That is you. We got the same shirt. Yeah, all right. How are you going to wander right next to the wanted board in the jail and be wanted? Where's the sheriff? sheriff. Ma'am, you have the power to keep him in here? Excuse me. I have to get yeah. another deputy just to survive. Okay. I mean, I like kind of brought him in, even though he was 10 feet away from the jail instead of like yeah. a half a mile. Sheriff Candy. Yeah, I got you. Uh, Ma'am, did I not help bring that gentleman in? Yes, you did. At sir. gunpoint, like a boss? <laughs> is that a, is that? I would consider that. He could have ran around the corner. A mighty fine achievement. Well, you know what? I'll take it. Thank you very much. What's up? No hard feelings, brother. You robbed me in the middle of the woods while I was trying to find an outhouse. And I'm like, hey guys, I'm just trying to find an outhouse. And they just waited for me. And for like 10 minutes, they're like, are you done yet? I'm like, don't shoot me. And they're like, we just want a photo with you. So they take a photo with me. I take the photo, taking selfies. And then they blast me point blank. I'm like bleeding from the belly. Happens to the best of us. Bleeding from the belly. Say goodbye to Mr. Jelly. <laughs> oh man. I'm in the jail right now, which I feel like is the safest spot possible. What you got, girl? Water. 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 Are you excited about the new mayor? I'm very excited about the new mayor. I like the new mayor because, you know, she's still keeping education. Everybody needs education. Even if you think you're a genius, you still need education. You know what? Amen to that. That is my awesome 11-year-old daughter, Madison, and this is her first event. What's going on here? We're going to circle up and get him. Jelly needs to get back to the office. <laughs> what are the odds of him living this short walk? Oh, my gosh. This is, this is personal security detail at its best. A lot of people might want to see Mayor Jelly dead now that he's not in power for him abusing stuff and not taking care of the town. But I have a huge respect for Sheriff Candy for escorting him anyway. What happens between them and how the mayor's defeat unfolds is pretty crazy. <laughs> it was just a personal security detail. I'm gonna get a drink from the saloon. Nice. We actually, we have a real barber up there above the bank. She's doing beard trims and haircuts. We're about to have a duel here. Oh, that's cool. Two men, mistaken identity. Hey, hey Jethro. Mistaken identity. Jethro, the sand, uh, rodent. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Am How I right? How dare you? Jethro, the sand rodent. <laughs> it's Jethro D. Fox. All right, back, oh, Jethro back, D. Five Fox. Pages. Oh, look who we have here. We've got Annie Smokely. Hey. Annie Smokely. You're live on Instagram, forgive me. Check it out. Oh, no, really? Yeah. Let me see that. She actually got this. I haven't gotten it yet. It is the victory coin. She, uh, how many achievements did you accomplish? Eleven. Yeah, that's awesome. That's cool. It was made 900 flat? I have 1931 in my account. Oh, dude, you're, uh, you almost have as much as me. <laughs> Oh, I'm not filming with my head. How's it going, Jet? Hello, yeah. everyone. Thanks Quite for tuning the in live to Swamp Cypher. <laughs> <laughs> Best part about this game, achievements. You gotta do 11 achievements. That's a big stack. There's all 11. And when you finish all 11, you get this gold mm. coin. Yeah, that's awesome. I I just have Gambler left, and they have to catch a fish. Oh, we gotta go find our so. Oh, gambler's. gambler's pretty even. That's awesome. Oh my, oh my goodness. Yeah, we need to do a game and you gotta do fishermen as well. We paid like a thousand dollar gem to the bar so that we would have a free tab all weekend for me and my uh, five crew. And it was pretty awesome. Should I just shoot someone randomly? Yes or no? Let's see it in the comments. Where's the spittoon? Everywhere. Yes, the answer is yes. Okay, let's do it. What'd you just say to me? See if it hurts? Yeah, you see if it hurts. What is that? It's a shotgun. No, you're not. Let me see the, I just wanna. Now he's gonna shoot me with it. What do you mean? Come on now, Christopher Battles. Got a safety on it? Why don't you take five steps back, son? No, that's my gun, you can't shoot me with my own. You're right. All right. I know rules. Hey, we're cool. We're cool. Everyone's cool. 
man threatened to shoot me with a shotgun. That's all that happened. It's all cool. Should I feel bad? Vote now. Sir, do you have any money on you? This is the first time I'm live in yeah, one of our role I play games. Have How money. much money do you have um, on you? I think Pat's the five. You think you just have a five? You can only take one bill. No, you can take up to one hundred dollars, which was in the briefing and everything. Hey, how much money can you take off someone? A hundred dollars, son. That's not nice. Is it? Is it not nice? You said, do I want to see if your shotgun hurts? Yeah. So now you learned a valuable lesson. I never lesson. said I was going to shoot you. It's all, oh, I know, I know. Here, you know what, you know what? Here, here you go. That's okay. You'll be all right. Somebody heal this man, not you. Can we go on the train? The train? You want to go on the train? Yes. Uh, I'm fine so going on the train. That that kid, that kid's gonna try to kill me now. He's gonna try to kill me. I feel bad. He was a little. He's trying to kill me. Oh, okay, okay. All right. What's up? For <laughs> giving us the opportunity of the land. Oh my goodness! Thank you, sir. What's your name? Luke. Luke. Like. Luke rhymes with Duke. Yep. Awesome. Dude, thank you very much, Luke. You're awesome. Got some of that. Maybe we'll take a train ride. This kid's gonna try to kill me with his shotgun. Madison, I need a Twizzler immediately. This is almost an emergency. Thank you. Arr. I've been live streaming for some time now. We witnessed the election. I shot some, oh, there he is, there he is. There he is. There he is with the shotgun. He is gonna try to get me. Here, get on the train. Okay. He knows. Get on the train. Get on the train. Get on the train. All right. Wait, is the train even about to leave? Should I hop on the train or should I go shoot this guy? Which one? Pigman beer. Pig man. <laughs> is that what it is? Pigman beer? Bear? bear? Man. I can't speak. Bear man pig. No pig, just bear man. Bear pig man? It's whatever you want at this point. Mr. Pig. Mr. Bear. <laughs> Mr. Pig Bear. How are you doing, Mr. Pig Bear? I'm doing all right. I awesome. prefer bear man. Have you gotten all the objectives done? Yes, sir. Really? Absolutely. Where's your coin? You got your coin? Or is it stashed? It's safe and tucked away in my carriage. Okay. Hey, I see what you're... I see... Oh, it's Whoa. now it's going to fall? It wasn't just balancing by itself? It looks like a very cheap holster. Ian. Yeah, I'm losing stuff everywhere. All right. Well, let's chill out. I don't feel very safe right now. You're, our people are not going to hurt you there. Let's go on the train. Go Baby, there. the train's not taking off anytime no, soon. You what? Yeah, because you know what? He said, you want to see if the shotgun hurts? And I was like, ah, oh, and I tried to, like, take it, and then he made it clear he didn't want me to shoot his shotgun. So, yeah. But I have to show people that if you're going to say, I'm going to shoot you, that they, you know, might get shot. That is cool. I'm not going to shoot it. I just want to see it. Dude. Gas shells or? How many shots per shell? Six. Oh, shoot. You know what? This is a live stream. Instagram's gonna be like, we're banning you from the world. Not really supposed to like. Should I come up? No? <laughs> All right, then I, you know what? I'm fine not coming up there. That's fine. <laughs> All right. All right, all right. I would prefer to not get shot right now. Mr. Pinkerton, can you make sure I don't get shot right now? Madison. Have you, you haven't shot someone today, right? Yeah. You have not? I haven't. Well, how about you change that? She could shoot you. Madison, you haven't shot someone today. Shoot that gentleman right there. Nope, you just, you have, you're, it's okay. He has given permission. In hindsight, this is messed up, but it's part of the game. Madison, do it. Just know I'm sorry. Just do it. Just know I'm sorry for this. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. You mean you'll let me shoot you and you'll give me a dramatic death? No. Oh. This feels weird. <laughs> oh, I can't do that. Now we're <laughs> the sheriff sees me. He's like, we're good. All right. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna go for a little train ride here. I just want to thank everyone. I'm gonna leave this video up. Nothing crazy's happened. I want to thank Elite Force. There's off for being awesome. I want to thank Jet Desert Fox, also known as the uh, Sand Rodent. And now, <laughs> no, 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 no. 
And then, uh, okay. Oh my gosh, the tactical unicorn or unicorn Leah. Also, C7 Viper, he's role played at our events and Rev and everything. Yeah. And he's just super freaking awesome. So, um, yeah. And now I'm going to get on the train. You can't get killed while you're on the train currently. So, there we go. I'm on the train. Hey, Mr. Conductor, can we get a little train ride going here? Absolutely. Ugh. Oh, it looks like the old mayor is still showing up in the mayor's office. Uh oh. Oh, dynamite. <laughs> Jack is throwing dynamite into town. And now people are killing people. Sir, can we get this uh, train, a, train a rolling before everything goes really, really bad? Is this filming? Are you sure? Yeah. I don't need to film right now. That feels nice. That feels nice. All right, I'm gonna give everyone, no, I'm gonna wear my hat, it's so hot. What? Here's what's happened. So yesterday, we're going for all these crazy objectives. We did not get all of them done. Crazy situations came about. And then today, we've gotten all these things done, but we have one final one called the gambler the achievement train. that we got to do. Eye for an eye, da, 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 da. eye for an eye. Eye for an eye. Watch out for that bullet. But if I uh, take off your head, you won't have any eyes. <laughs> it's simple. Don't threaten someone. Right? He was he threatened me earlier with a shotgun. I had to shoot him. I didn't have a choice. So uh, we're here on the train at Balahack Airsoft. Um, we just had a really peaceful election. Like, that was really peaceful. We do have land for sale. Um, All right. Um, if you give me your soul. No, I'm good. <laughs> All right, we can arrange something when we get back in town and uh, sign over a deed. Like, you got to have some money for sure to do it. Anyway, we've been having a blast. I caught a fish yesterday in the competition, and you'll see what happens with that when I actually make the video going around on the train. So I've had a blast this whole time. That is someone swimming in the pond. You all right, girl. Welcome aboard. Oh, it's the new mayor. Woo! She won. Her name's Micah. She's a player, and now that means she's automatically the mayor next year. She'll have her own office, tons of money, some resources, maybe some oil bonds, stuff like that. Hey, this looks like a full train. Everyone say hi, Instagram. Hi, Instagram. Yeah. Can I get a yee-haw? Uh, you haven't done anything like it, but you probably haven't. It's because I really haven't until it's until doing it. It's so hot. It's your first time. It's You're first literally time. the mayor. I, I have never roleplayed. I have never airsofted. I have never cosplayed. <laughs> yeah, it's so I great. Am mayor. <laughs> you too can be the mayor. <laughs> you, can make, you make your own story. Yeah, and that's what this is all about. Like, you could just like do almost nothing if you want um or you could just go crazy the whole day but oh look a cow this election episode was peaceful because this next and final one is not orion nettling you just won an elite four smoke wagon signed by me and all of you who are watching you guys subscribe and like and answer this question how much money is in doug's bank account you can win one for the next video. Thanks for dealing with the live stream. I wanted to switch it up and show you everything that happens. Also, you can get all your airsoft equipment on balahackairsoft.com. We're about to launch a whole new e-com store. And whatever you do in life, stay safe, enjoy it, be creative, and peace.